There's a new store at Somerset Mall offering some unique cooking classes. And joining us now to talk about all that, Chef Lisa Woodward from Sur La Table. She's also making an easy recipe that you can make for dinner tonight. Chef, thanks for being here. And uh, what's on the menu? We're going to do arroz con pollo today. It's a one dish uh, Latin American rice with chicken dish. And it's a fabulous thing to make during the week if you're in a hurry, you're busy. Not a lot of cleanup, not, not a lot of fuss. And uh, we can just get going. Okay, and these are the basic ingredients we start with right yeah. here. We started, I, I've already seared some chicken and some chorizo right here. And that's just waiting. And now we've got hot oil cooking in the pan. Okay. And if you could go ahead and add the diced onions and red peppers. All right. And I'll give that a wow. stir. So you can sort of hear a little sizzle. Yeah. How long would it have hot. taken to get that chicken ready in advance? Um, about seven minutes. Okay. Yeah, you put it in uh, this pan. We, we use this pan also. You just put it in. You want to make sure that the oil is very, very hot. And you put it in, let it sear very quickly. Um, and when it's cooked, it will release. So don't try and pull it out prior. To, wait if it sticks. Okay. And then let it sit a few more minutes. So now you can go ahead and add the garlic. Garlic, all right. Smells yeah, this is great. a coarse chopped garlic. Okay. And now you'll start to sort of smell the flavors yeah. are starting to bloom. It's really delicious. Smells fantastic. Okay, so next is the white wine. Okay. Got that in there. And so it's a little dry white wine and some crushed tomatoes. That's this one? That's that one. <laughs> I'm a rookie chef over oh, here. You're doing a great yeah, job. Got that all in there, all right? Yeah. And then we've got some kosher salt and some turmeric and cumin That's and paprika. This and one? That was all in that one oh, bowl you just did. Okay. Yeah, so now we're pretty much good. We're going to let this simmer just for a second. You actually turn the heat up just a bit. And then and capers. That actually won't go in. Oh, okay. That's a garnish. I'm like all ready so. to dive in there. <laughs> oh, yeah. Capers are great. And so the last thing that we're going to put in is... Um, before we do the rice, you put the chicken and everything back in. Okay. So I'm just going to put a few pieces. And how long would this whole process take on the stovetop? Um, you're, aside from searing, you're looking at the whole process. Oh, great. Okay. So, you know, maybe a couple more minutes if you slowed it down. This is chicken broth, and we're going to add this. And if you could put the rice in. Okay. This is the last ingredient. That's the last okay. ingredient. All right. And so all you want to do is bring this to a boil. And that'll take a minute, so we're just going to stir it in there. I'm going to bring it to a boil, and then you want to take the top. When it comes to a boil, you cover it, and you cook it for nine more minutes. And after it cooks for nine minutes, you take it off the burner and let it sit for five more, and you're done. And that's the final product right over there? That is the final. Yeah, I have one final one product. Here too. Yeah. This is a final product pot of it and you can see you can actually serve it in this beautiful Le Creuset dish if you'd like to put it on a trivet on your table it'll work fine and we have a plate already done over there That's and if you want to taste it you're welcome to. We're running out of time but I do want to mention the cooking demonstrations and classes you have at the store hit on that we real do quick. we have a real variety from Thai cooking to gluten-free baking we do knife skills classes so anything you can think of you can find it on our schedule it's very easy to find very easy to register.